no false rap. I got four cars and they all black. Got four bras and they all that. We call that ballin'. Doing this is my calling. Flow is so appalling. My phone off and she calling. I'm like, yeah, what it do? Morning, guys. Um, my eyes hurt. I didn't sleep much last night, like four hours. I'm up now. I'm gonna. I'm going to Sacramento, which is like an hour away from where I live. I'm gonna help out my uncle with some projects, uh, along with my my older cousin Melissa, the one who graduated uh, recently that you guys saw. Um, and uh, so I'm gonna be there for a few hours today, guys. Um, so I hit up I hit up Matt because Matt kind of lives in the Sacramento, well, kind of in the Sacramento area, uh, maybe like 30, 45 minutes away from where I'm gonna be. But I figured, hey, it's in the general direction. Might as well, you know, pay him a visit, stop by, maybe check out his new pup. Maybe get a workout in. I'm gonna have to get a workout in later at some point. Um, so yeah, I'm just waiting for him to hit me back, see if he's not busy. I know it was kind of last minute, so we'll see if he uh, uh, wants to meet up. If not, regardless, I'm gonna get a workout later. Um, yeah, I'm just looking forward to it. You know, I know um, no sleep and you know late nights, you wake up kind of feeling like shit, like what I am right now. But um, that'll change. And if I need like a little energy drink or something, and eh, eh, la la. la. If I need a little energy drink or something, I might get like a white monster. Um, but that being said, puppy, pup, puppy, puppy, puffy face aside, <laughs> let's tackle the day. Let's go get it. Um, I'm excited. I'm excited. Bruh, she's sitting sexy as fuck, huh? What's good guys, just left my uncle's house. I tinted some windows in his house, which was the first time I've ever done that. So just learning more and more, I'm excited about it. I wanna apply it later. Maybe, um, I don't know, in one way or another. I feel like it's gonna help me out. Anyway, I'm at the UPS store, I'm about to drop this off. This is my, uh, it's an aftermarket intake for my Corvette. Somebody's buying it off me. So I just gotta finish packaging it up and sending it off. And then I'm gonna go meet up with Matt, get some Chipotle and chat it up. He doesn't really wanna get a workout in because uh, his tendonitis is acting up, he says. Um, which sucks he probably has like golfers and tennis elbows what he says which is both when you extend and like curl so that sucks um, and it's his off day so I'm not gonna force him to work out she's gonna get a meal in with him he's about 45 minutes away and uh, yeah from there probably just go get my own workout in and stuff like that so check back with you we out here waiting for Matt Fuck, trend oh. Meeting trend for the first time <laughs> Second, buddy. Let me we know who's the pitcher and catcher in this relationship. <laughs> What's up, bro? Been a long time. <sighs> Smells so good. Dude, how's he gonna How's he gonna close that? That's insane. Wow. Hey, Trent. Look at this guy. Look how friendly he is. Good boy. Yeah. It's the thing about golden retrievers, man. They love anything and everyone. Gotta love him. I had one just like this. That's a good boy. No, that's not yours. That's not yours. Look at that bird refeeding. Just chilling here, eating chipotle, a lot of fat. Like Matt said, he ain't no bitch. That gimpy bird eating that refeed. Yeah. Great minds think alike. Good shit. So we're here at. Did it turn on? Yeah. We're here at Chipotle and uh, we're laughing because Matt's telling me what he feeds Trent. <laughs> <laughs> he says <laughs> he says he spends like 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 probably like it's like hundred dollars a month at least right now. At least hundred dollars a month on this on this little pipe that weighs. It'll be two to three times that when he gets older. Chomp. Yeah, it'll be two to three times that when he gets older on like natural dog food that's supposed to. Be very similar to uh, what dogs eat in nature, you know, like we were talking about evolutionarily, if that's even a word. Um, like, like all types of chicken. Real, like raw like, chicken. Raw. Like every part of that damn chicken. Like it's beak, it's guts, liver, brain, all that good stuff. It's a, uh, you guys can look it up. It's um, Northwest Naturals. Northwest Naturals, remember that? He's a bodybuilder. Oh, uh, and, uh, and <laughs> Trend eats from there? Trend? Yeah, trend eats natural. <laughs> But then, but then, but then tell him, tell him oh, how you don't did. prioritize yourself. Oh, well, wait, wait, even before that, when it comes to his food, I don't even microwave it. I don't believe in feeding him microwaves. I, I heat up the water and then I add that to the food. But anyway, I'm thinking to myself, I'm like prioritizing like how natty and raw he eats. But then when it comes to me, I'm just like, I don't do any of that shit. You like microwave fucking like metal and eat it? Like, here I am fucking 
eating like froyo and shit that never <laughs> occurred naturally. That's good though. You care about your son. That's why I care about way more. You gotta love your dog, man. You gotta love the doggy. Man, I, <laughs> I feed him the best shit. <laughs> the best shit. Cause he's not allowed in the buffet, so you gotta feed him the best shit at home. That's cool though, that's cool. Alright guys, off to the gym, just hung out with Matt. Very good to catch up uh, and meet his dog, Tren. I just figured it was a good opportunity to, uh, you know, say what's up to my boy. Hopefully I can meet up with him soon. Anyway, uh, about an hour to uh, the gym I'm going to. I'm stopping at the gym on the way home. And uh, try not to get home too late because I have to go uh, feed my doggy. So, uh, yeah guys, check back with you in a bit. Back in the car after that workout, guys. I feel amazing, man. My cut's going well. Uh, doing a lot of Q&As on my Snapchat during cardio. Like, I'm only supposed to do uh, 350 calories each session. And today I did like over 600 because um, it just keeps me entertained and, and productive. Um, sometimes I can't film in the gym. I apologize, guys. One, uh, I may not have a workout partner with me as my memory card got full. Um, I had to delete some stuff. But anyway, what I was saying is um, I might not have a workout partner with me, which obviously makes things easier to film, or especially Lino, who helps me with my uh, my videos with his epic camera and the editing. So, uh, you know, I, that makes it harder, obviously, not having somebody with me. And also, when I'm in a new environment and a new gym, or even if um, it's really busy, sometimes it's hard to pull out the camera. So I just focus on my workout. I'm sure you guys understand. Um, you know, I do my best as far as that. Um, I'm, I'm gonna definitely, you know, be doing it whenever I get an opportunity to. But, but uh, the bottom line, I'm feeling really good on my cut. Um, things are going really well. Feeling the best I have in, you know, since my 2013 cut. To be honest, I'm excited to see what another, you know, 12, 13 pounds of weight loss looks like. It should put me, you know, within a few pounds of what my stage weight was in 2013. So I'm excited to, you know, compare and contrast and see if I've made improvements or stayed the same or even lost a little muscle, who knows, as natural, right? But I'm sure it's gonna look good. That's what I'm looking forward to. I'm looking forward to see, you know, even in like five, six, seven pounds, see what that looks like. So if I'm happy, I'm happy. If not, I'll keep cutting. I'm patient, you know, patience is a, a, a big important thing. So I tell that to my clients all the time. Again, going home to answer some client emails, um, as always, and uh, get the rest of my macros in and feed Lexi, my German Shepherd. Um, if you guys need some help with coaching, you guys don't want to think about your protocol, you guys want to you know, progress in every way, shape, and form with your training, nutrition, all that stuff, uh, feel free to uh, hit me up at www.coachyuck.com. If you have any questions about coaching, coachlovato at yahoo.com. Uh, feel free to ask me. I'm, I'll be happy to help you, you know, within reason. Um, but I do give my full care to my clients. So, uh, yeah, results are looking great. Not only for myself, for my clients, I'm happy. Life is good. All right, guys, thank you for watching.